Hey guys, so there are two news that's related to SAT or SAT exams. First one is a lot of universities have said that they will stop requiring or uh, stop making SAT or ACT tests mandatory. Uh, for admissions uh, because of the pandemic and now with health officials still unsure about um, until when or will everything be closed and the pandemic will be controlled they have said that uh, if the colleges um, if uh, the colleges don't reopen by fall they will reconsider um, they will also consider taking these tests online so if schools don't reopen by fall students will be able to take the tests from home so then the organization said that they they will make up for the tests that were not held now um in the spring and if it will be safe to do so they said that they'll start offering the SATs uh, from August every month uh, until like December and this whole announcement have come when a lot of colleges have already dropped uh, the requirements like around 51 colleges in the US have dropped the requirement of uh, these tests and a lot are also considering of making it uh, optional they have actually made it optional and a lot of them are still considering making it optional and in fact some of them are, are making it optional for a long time like Tufts University has made it optional for three years and then the Northeastern University and some others they have said that they are making the test optional for uh, until like 2021. They also said that when they'll be taking uh, these tests at home uh, the if anyone else enters the room or passes by like the parents are there then there'll be a monitor um, that can actually uh, you know sense that and they'll be able to know that when the student is taking the test uh, so there are a few challenges or like few critiques that people are saying uh, one is that uh, you know parents might not want that much to happen with their personal computers or they might not like uh, that much invasion in privacy um, another critique that is uh, that people are saying another thing is that you know like poor students or economically uh, there are different classes right so uh, some students might not have everything available at home uh, when they are at home with like let's say 10 other family members it might be difficult for them to take the test uh, so those will those will be some challenges uh, also but as of now this is what they have announced um, and obviously the whole uh, pandemic situation is making uh, so many changes in all our lives uh, all we can hope for and pray for is that things get better and everything gets back to normal take care